The tunnel, which sits under Waver Tree Botanic Gardens, is thought to have been built before World War II and later used as an air raid shelter for staff at the famous Littlewood site. Known to many in the area for the part it played in protecting workers at the Littlewood factory near the Blitz, during which Liverpool was the second most bombed city in the UK, the bunker has 13 entrances and is 300 metres long. One of the tunnel's mysteries is the faces that are on the walls of one section of the bunker. The drawings have initials underneath them. Keen to find out more about them, Kyle May began tracing the faces after he first laid eyes on them. Kyle noticed that one of the faces had an initial U next to it and thought that not many names began with the letter U. So he began to trace. After a lot of researching, Kyle managed to narrow his search down to two possibilities and eventually one lady was left who seemed to fit the bill. Her name was Ursula Loris Forshaw. Land ahead. That's how you get out of a, an old air raid shell. So this is just under a field, well a park actually, uh, in Liverpool, and the one in Wigan, what we went to, that uh, had the capacity of 600 people. This is the entrance. Yeah. We we'll just we we'll just put some bricks on that so we don't fall back down on us. There is there, yeah. There isn't this bit. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Nobody will experience anything like that. This is what we were just processing yesterday. We were all in places and people don't experience it, do they? Oh. So don't we don't know where it is. Two, turn right and look, seven. Number seven. You know what I mean? People don't experience it, do they? No. Anything like this. At all. So it's right. I see. It's right next to a massive building. Just on the other, you can't just at the top of that fence on the other side of there. It's a massive building. And this air raid shelter just sat, as I say, in a park next to some trees.
find our way out.